Hello, this is Mike at Game from Scratch, and I'm here with a quick question. Would you like to see me do some tutorials on Hacks Flixel? Now, this is a little strange because I've been getting a lot of requests for it lately, probably more so than any other language slash engine slash uh, framework combination out there. Um, and sometimes this is because, you know, you've got a small coordinated group of people asking me, or it could be indicative that a larger community is interested in seeing more uh, about Hacks Flixel. Now, I've done some Hacks content in the past, and it wasn't exceedingly popular. There wasn't a lot of demand for it. That's why I figured I'd throw this video up here and ask you guys straight up, would you guys like to see uh, Hackslixel coverage going forward? Like, would you like me to do tutorial series on this one? Or would you rather I pass? Now, if you've never heard of it, Hacks, well, first off, Hacks is a language, probably the spiritual successor to ActionScript, the programming language behind Flash. But it is sort of a meta language. It compiles down to, or transpiles down to various other programming languages. So you can use Hacks to generate HTML or JavaScript code. You can use hacks to generate um, C++ code, which can then be natively compiled on whatever platform you want. And you can also use hacks to compile to its own native machine. So it's a very cross-portable language. Um, now, the Hacks Flixel library itself is built over top of OpenFL and Lime, which is a low-level media framework, sort of like SDL or SFML in scope. Uh, now, Hacks Flixel itself is a port of an old Flash library called Flixel. Uh, it's very straightforward. It's a 2D game engine, completely open source. Uh, as you can see, it's available on GitHub. It is pretty well documented. There are quite a few examples available, um, but you know, maybe you want my unique take on things. Uh, but if you look at the documentation, you got a pretty good idea of the kind of services that hacks uh, Flixel actually provides. You can see here you've got support for add-ons, animation, special effects, graphics, grouping, uh, various kinds of input, uh, math, system, text, uh, tiles, uh, tweening, a UI, and various utilities. And then, you know, we get in here, we've got things like, you know, sprites and um, sprite strips, animations like that. So, you know, there is a lot of the functionality you expect here from a 2D game engine. This is a full-blown 2D game engine for sure. And again, hacks language um, may be of interest to some of you. You may not. Now, I, again, I've been getting a lot of requests for this, so I thought I would throw it to you guys, the community. Would you like to see me do some Hacks Flixel tutorial coverage, or would you rather I did it? Please do let me know in the comments down below, or if I can get somehow figure out how to get a poll working up here, I will throw someone up as well. Um, so, hope you found that. Well, I guess there's nothing to be interested in here. Let me know if you are interested. If you are, uh, please, again, do comment down below, or um, if I can get a poll going, vote in the poll. Uh, if you're not, you know, that's okay, too. You know, hit or miss. I'd rather make the content you guys want to see, or that I'm personally interested in. Sometimes that's what's going to decide it. Uh, then, you know, wasting time on content that nobody is actually interested in, other than a very, very, very small part of the community. Um, so, uh, do let me know. Thank you all. See you all later. Goodbye.